there is major breaking news this morning uh, that will affect the economy in this country. Major business announcement. Target, the U.S. retailer, has just announced it is shutting down, discontinuing its Canadian operations. Scott Peterson here. Target pulling out of Canada, Scott. What a huge announcement. This is going to affect 133 stores across Canada and 17,600 jobs. Those are the amount of jobs that are employed by Target in Canada. They're saying that they're going to give employees a, a minimum of uh, 16 weeks of compensation. That's four months of wages. But a huge announcement this morning from uh, Target's CEO in Canada saying they just simply are unable to make any profit. They don't see anything happening profit-wise until 2020. One, so can we just stop there just for a second? Because we have this graphically, just so people can understand the statement that just came out. So here is the official wording from Brian Cornell, the corporate uh, chair and the CEO, and exactly what Scott was saying. Unable to find a way to improve the performance and transform the company here. So they reviewed it and unable to find a realistic scenario that would get Target Canada to profitability until at least 2021. So, they so made, yeah. yes. So they made a decision that's just much too long to take and it's also costing them money. They've got, they've got here estimates it's costing between 500 million to 600 million per year that they're taking losses on their balance sheet. So a huge announcement from Target this morning and we're seeing that stocks, uh, it's already up in trading, that people are liking this announcement, just saying that they've incurred such losses and a damage to the reputation as far as the rollout. But this here. is a botch from the beginning. Let's just be clear on this. Remember, we, they came into Canada, everyone's so excited, then there was nothing on the store shelves, there were, uh, you know, poor service, the prices were too high cost people their jobs at the highest level, correct? It, it, correct. They changed the CEO. There was a, there was a, a scattered uh, 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 introduction in this country. Before that, it looked good. They came in with the advertising. It looked great, but you're right. The, the initial contact with the Canadian public was poor. They, the short stores were poorly stocked. Uh, people were going to the U.S. finding better deals, so the optics were terrible. So at this point, it's Target saying that they couldn't they overcome do. that bad reputation, that first introduction, which is so important. And this is really a model what happens when a U.S. giant comes in. Exactly, and, and what kind of a signal does it send? Anyway, we're going to get more on this, but as Scott mentioned, 17,000 plus people, and the company also announcing there's going to be a bit of an employee trust fund set up to allow these people some sort of money as a parachute as they find out they're about to lose their job. So more on this to come. Scott, just breaking target Huge. out of Canada. Stay right here for the details on CBC News Network.